I don't like getting up early, but when I do, I use the snooze button on my alarm clock. I'm a slave to the snooze button. And uh, for me, I, I just get so frustrated with the, uh, with the amounts of time in the snooze cycle, you know? Seven minutes, nine minutes. Why can't they just make a 10 minute snooze and make it easy for everybody? <laughs> it's bad enough you have to get up early for work. Now you have to do math at dawn. I can just see this as a word problem in schools today. Like, Bobby needs to be up by 6.30 a.m. He sets his alarm for 5.54 a.m. Assuming a seven minute snooze cycle, how lazy can Bobby be? <laughs> the check engine light came out of my car. I don't really know what to do now. I guess I'll just start with a radiator and work my way back. Um, it's so frustrating because you know there's something wrong, but it won't tell you what the problem is. Hey folks, that's a girlfriend. <laughs> to me, a check engine light is just a girlfriend sitting on the hood going, figure it out. <laughs> Was it the fan belt? No. Was it the carburetor? If you don't know, now I'm not gonna tell you. <laughs> so, I uh, popped into a can of Pringles last week. Um, how small does your hand have to be to get to the bottom of that can of Pringles? <laughs> what kind of pygmies are running this company? <laughs> like, hi, Bob Johnson, Vice President of Marketing. How you doing? <laughs> You've been a great audience, thanks very much. Thank you. Bye-bye.